वेलकम टू यूट्यूब चैनल साइंटिफिक अंडर स्कोर मैथ वी आर स्टडिंग टाइप्स ऑफ मैट्रिस विदिनेशन प्रॉपर्टीज एंड एग्जाम्पल ओके लर्निंग ऑब्जेक्टिव इन प्रीवियस लेक्चर्स वी हैव स्टडीड डायग्नली डोमिनेंट मैट्रिक्स हरमिशियन मैट्रिक्स एंड स्क्यू हरमिशियन मैट्रिक्स आई विल प्रोवाइड द लिंक इन वीडियो डिस्क्रिप्शन ऑफ ऑल दिस लेक्चर्स यू कैन वॉच एंड in this lecture we will discuss positive definite positive and negative definite and semi definite matrix and uh, we will also solve uh, some examples related to the positive definite matrix and the uh, negative definite uh, definite and semi definite matrix so let's start today lecture test for positive and negative definite or semi definite matrix uh, we have some tests uh, to identify the whether the given matrix is positive or uh, negative definite and uh, semi -de definite matrix okay so first one we have a matrix a, a matrix a is positive definite if it is symmetric and uh, all its eigen values are positive so this one is the first test to identify the whether the given matrix a is positive definite or uh, uh, not okay so we can also identify uh, the positive negative definite if the eigen values are not positive uh, then the matrix is a negative definite or semi definite matrix okay so uh, we will also solve the example related to the uh, first test in uh, next lecture Uh, in this lecture we will discuss only test related to the positive and uh, negative definite and semi definite matrix okay so second one we have all upper left or leading determinants are positive so uh, if the uh, all the leading determinants of the matrix a is positive then the given matrix is a positive definite matrix uh, uh, definite or semi definite otherwise the given matrix is negative definite or a semi definite matrix when the matrix is semi definite when uh, we have uh, any eigen value is zero and then the matrix is a semi definite matrix okay so third one test we have a matrix a uh, is positive definite if it is symmetric and all its pairs are positive and uh, what does it mean it's mean when we do elimination and uh, then we will see if uh, the all the diagonal elements are positive and then the given matrix is positive definite matrix we will also solve example related to the uh, test theory okay so the fourth test we have in the product of uh, a transpose into a that is the given matrix the transpose of given matrix into the uh, matrix a uh, when we multiply and, and both uh, these a transpose and to the matrix a we get Uh, matrix x and that matrix x will sh uh, should be independent columns means no zero columns all the like that 1 0 0 and 0 2 3 and 1 2 0 so here we can see that there is no zero column zero column and if we do uh, zero this one then we can see that this is zero column mean this is dependent columns okay so here we can see that there is no uh, 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 independent columns and no zero columns so this one have the no zero column and this is the independent matrix okay so uh, the fourth test we have an n cross n means a square matrix a symmetric matrix with the real entries and uh, the matrix x of order n cross 1 mean column uh, vector then the product of x transpose a into x and that is the quadratic form what uh, what is quadratic form uh, we will discuss it later and uh, for all vector x that is not equal to 0 is said to be negative definite if the product of this one is less than 0 and uh, when and the column vector is not equal to 0 and uh, this will be the matrix will be negative semi definite if the product of this one is less than or equal to 0 okay here we can see that there is the there is the condition 
and the, uh, the product of this one uh, b equal to 0 when the column vector is not equal to 0 and uh, number third we have the matrix will be positive definite matrix uh, if the product is greater than 0 okay when the uh, uh, column uh, column vector is not equal to 0 and the fourth one we have and the matrix uh, a or any matrix uh, a square matrix positive it will be positive definite if positive semi definite if the product of this one is greater than or equal to zero its mean and the product can be equal to zero when the column vector is not equal to zero so these are five tests to identify the whether the given matrix is positive and negative definite and semi definite matrix in the next lecture we will discuss examples related to each test and uh, now we will discuss the properties of a positive definite matrix okay symmetric positive definite matrix has all uh, real positive eigenvalues means all eigenvalues will be greater than zero here lambda indicate eigenvalue and that is greater than zero okay second one an hermitian uh, strictly diagonally dominant matrix with real positive diagonal entries is positive positive definite we have already a studied hermitian matrix and the strictly strictly diagonally diagonally dominant matrix uh, i will provide the link of our um, both these uh, lectures in the video description you can watch hermitian matrix and the what is a strictly diagonally dominant matrix okay so here uh, 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 a matrix that is Hermitian and strictly diagonal dominant and the matrix is always the positive definite matrix. Okay, next one we have a, a Hermitian diagonally dominant matrix with a real non-negative diagonal entries is a positive semi-definite. Here non-negative means uh, diagonal entries can be zero. Okay, so third next we have fourth one. Hermitian matrix A is only positive semi definite, then uh, it still has a decomposition of the form A is equal to LTL transpose. Okay, so we can uh, apply the actually uh, I apply the LTL trans uh, LTL uh, transpose uh, means we can apply the actually uh, uh, decomposition on this uh, matrix A. So Third, uh, next one we have the Chilisky decomposition is possible when the given matrix is a positive definite matrix. Okay, so all the these are the properties of uh, the positive definite matrix, and uh, and these are the five tests to identify the matrix positive or negative definite and uh, semi definite matrix. And uh, in the next lecture, we will solve example uh, to each. Uh, related to the each and test means we will solve five examples uh, related to each test okay so thank you so much for watching my video please subscribe my channel scientific underscore math for more videos related to the mathematics